Welcome back to my channel, WhatsApp Entrepreneur. In the previous video, we talked about how running a WhatsApp referral contest can be a game changer for your WhatsApp account, helping you attract thousands of new viewers and build a loyal fan base for yourself. However, we also acknowledge that manually running every single aspect of a referral contest can be very, very time consuming and frustrating. That's why, in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can automate the entire process from creating unique referral links to tracking their referrals and choosing your winners every single thing is going to be done automatically. With this, you'll be able to run your referral contest with ease and confidence without having to sacrifice your valuable time and energy. So, if you haven't watched my previous video on how you can set up a referral contest, I will highly recommend that you watch it right now. I'll be linking it up somewhere around here. So once you have that set up, come back to this video and I'm going to share with you how you can automate the entire process. And if you already watched that video, then let's get started. But before we dive into the practical aspect of automating the entire WhatsApp referral contest, I'm going to be going over the requirements that you need to make sure that this referral contest works for you. Firstly, you're going to need an Android device with good specifications because low-end devices have a tough time running these automations. And also, if you use an iPhone, then you'll not be able to use this automation on your phone. And a good way to be sure if your Android device can run this automation is to check if you can use applications like Autoresponder for WhatsApp or Autoreply or any other similar application. And if you can use those applications or you use them flawlessly on your current device, then you don't have any problem. But if you don't have these applications or you are not sure if it will work, I have a video down below in the description that will show you exactly how you can check to see if this automation will work for you. Secondly, you're going to need these two applications, Autoresponder for WhatsApp and Google Sheets. These two applications are the backbone of our entire referral contest automation because it allows us to track referrals and automate messages for every single person in our WhatsApp DM. Lastly, there are going to be a couple more applications that I'm not going to be disclosing in this video. What? Don't fear because they are all easily accessible on the Google Play Store. So, assuming you have all of these requirements, let's move on to my devices where I'm going to show you a demo of how this works in real time. Welcome to my phone slash laptop because you can see both of them here. And here on my phone, I have opened this autoresponder interface as you would see right here. This is the test interface. And the reason why I'm using this test interface is because I don't want this test to affect my normal WhatsApp because I have my normal WhatsApp here. I don't want it to affect people there. This is why I'm using the test interface. And then on the left hand side, we have the referral sheet that we are going to be using to monitor everything about this, uh, this referral contest automation. And I'm going to be going through the entire process from A to Z so you can follow through. And you can understand how this works. So first off, we have to set up an automation for when people ask for a link. So now let's say I send the word referral link, right? And then I send this message. So as you see right here, I instantly get a referral number as number one. And then I also get a link for this referral contest which is with this link now once i reload you see that there's now a new selection called autoresponder right as you see right here and then the referral number is number one and it records that there are zero referrals that have been sent by autoresponder so now what will happen if i try to get a referral link again after already getting it as autoresponder when i send this message the response is going to be, you already have a code, don't send traffic to my DM. As I'll punch you, this is totally uh, editable, right? This is just me, you know, for, for the sake of testing. So if I keep sending this message, I am not going to get a new link, right? Let me try to make this another name, right? So let me make this Victor James. This is going to be my own name. And now I say referral link and as you see this is a new person right i'm simulating a new person texting me you understand and i send this message so the next thing is going to say is your referral number two here is your um, link and as you see right here it's get updated that victor james has refer uh, has been registered for this referral contest as you see right here so that's basically how this works so if i decide to add to say referral contest another time, right? If I decide to request for a referral link again, I still will not get 
any code because I have, I have asked for a referral link already. So this particular setting, you can turn it off that if you've already given them a link, you might decide not to reply with, to them again or you can decide to send them a message and reply something totally different. It is up to you. And now if I now click this link, it's going to take me to my WhatsApp DM. But what I'm going, I'm not going to be sending that message from my WhatsApp DM. I'm going to copy this message, right? I'm going to copy this message and I'm going to take it back here. And I'm not going to put it to random name. So now, if a participant wants to refer someone to your WhatsApp, the person will obviously be someone that you don't already have their number saved on your phone. Do you understand? So for that to happen, the person has to be an unsaved number as you see right here which says test so when the person sends this message we want two things to happen so the first thing that we want to happen is that we want this once they send this message we want their number to be saved right i also want to know who referred the person so as you see in this message it says hi victor i like to join your tv i was referred by referral two which is because i clicked on the link for referral two if I had clicked on the first link belonging to autoresponder, it would be referral 1. Do you understand? And then my name is Victor, but let's not use Victor. Let's use test. So now, let's say I try to send this message from referral number 2. I send this. Right, you are going to see this that says, Hello there, test. Welcome to my TV. A referral for referral 2 has been registered successfully. Right. And then you get a message that test has been added. And as you see updated here, the number of referrals has updated and it is now 1. So now if I go to my phone contacts, right, and I come to my contacts, and I search for tests. Right, test, TRC, this is it right here, 454.6, blah, 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 right, which is the same thing as it is right here, 454.6, test, right, this is it. That has been saved. And now if I come here to the second sheet, you will see that this person was fed by referral number 2 and his name was Test, which is a, you can see right here. Now let's say I try to send that message again and I paste it, right, and I send it and I say the name is Biggie, right, and I send it, it's not going to reply. Why? Because the number is still the same thing. As it has registered this number as a referral to uh, number two is not going to register that number again. So now let's say I want to now uh, get a new referral. That is another number, right? It's not going to trigger again for that same number. It has to be another number. And I now send this message. Mm -hmm. And I'll put a different name there. Right. And I'll put a different name. A different name being uh, Biggie. Now send the message. I'm going to see, it's going to say, hello there, Biggie. Welcome to the TV. Your referral for referral number two has been registered successfully. All right, here it is. And as you will see right here, it has been updated. So now Biggie has two referrals. Can you see? So it's also the same thing if we should, you know, create a new random name, which is another number. And we should put, uh, make this referral number one. All right, make this referral number one. And then I now put a name like uh, um, Naruto. Let's put Naruto there. And then I send this message. Say, hello there, Naruto. Welcome to my TV. Your referral for referral number one has been registered successfully. All right, as you see, and the next thing you see, number one has a new referral. And as you see right here, this is updated. If you look at this, it will look as if this is just the same thing as this one. But it is not. There is a very, very key difference here. And I'm going to show you. So right here, let's say I had this. Let me copy this. Right. And then I paste it here. Right. You will notice that this becomes 4. Now let's say I now added one more. And I'll increase this to 20, 30 or something. You will see that number one comes to the bottom over here and number two comes up. And the reason for that is that I made a simple code for this automation that makes sure that the person that is leading in this particular uh, referral contest is going to get updated here at the bottom. So you will see that this person has uh, the highest. So now let's say I try to 
make this up to 10 or 14 you see that number one is still going to be at the bottom and everything else is going to be zero upwards like this now let's say i make number five i give number five um let's say i give number five like 50 something plus you see number five will become the person that is leading right and then you see it is here number seven at the seventh row here but here it is at the last place so no matter the amount of leads that you drive no matter the amount of people that each person drives you would be able to see from the bottom here the amount the persons that are winning and the person with the highest number of referrals right it's just as simple as that and this is the way this works your contact gets saved they are updated here automatically without you having to press a single button and every single thing is updated automatically so all you have to do is open this sheet scroll down to wherever you know they've the people have gotten them to and you know instantly the person that is winning and then you can also as i said click on this link and you'll be able to send them a whatsapp message so i'm going to do this from my phone let me go to google sheets my phone i'm going to open this same sheet all right i'm going to open this same sheet just let it update right and then i click on send whatsapp message and then it's going to open my whatsapp straight as you see this is my whatsapp account i'm not going to be showing the chat but this is my whatsapp as you see right here so anybody that drives a lead to your whatsapp you are able to instantly get to their charts without doing anything extra and that's this the simple sweet way that this automation works you never have to create links manually ever again you don't have to save your contacts again because i don't even think i showed you right if you check the contacts i will search for naruto right naruto as you see here it is saved automatically into your phone all right so now you might be wondering that what would happen if someone was to you know send the message and they did not add their name because you know when you're running a referral contest run the risk of running into a lot of people that are just not as smart as you normally want right what would happen if these guys don't put their name inside of the message and for that there is a simple error message that we can add to the message so that when they send the message and they don't have their name we can arrest the situation and let them know how they need to reply before their participation can be recorded do you understand because if they don't add their name they are not going to get recorded as a referral so let's just change this 152 to 2 right and now let's say we send this message without adding a name Right, what message are we going to get is that we're going to get the message that says hey there your referral has not been counted because you have made a mistake you're supposed to send your message like this right I'll, 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 my name is victor you get still let's you let them know that they should put their name there so it tells them to resend the message accordingly and only then would their participation be recorded now let's say we have strong led I will send the message again like that and we put in you still get that message so it's only when you paste the message and then you now had a name kind of like the biggie and then you send it that's the only time where it's not say hey there biggie welcome to my tv your referral for referral 152 has been registered successfully and then now you see that it says biggie added but since i registered it for 152 it's not going to show up here so now if you come here we are going to see that it says Biggie and 152. So if I should change these two here to 152, we'll see that yes, it has a referral here. So that's basically how it works. So I'm going to change this back and we are good. So with this error message rule in your referral contest, you'll be able to reduce a lot of headache that's going to come because there are people that are going to come into your WhatsApp and then they will just decide not to add the name. Do you understand? So with this, if they don't put their name this would message them and tell them what they need to do so you don't have to do it by yourself and another thing i would like you to tell your referrals is that they should make sure to tell the people that they are sharing this link their links to that they should always put their name together with the message or else it's not going to get counted and if they don't you are here to let them know that oh this is your mistake just do it very well and you are good so with that said, let's move on. All right, that was a quick demo of how easy it is to run your own referral contest using this automation. Now, I know what you're thinking, but let me assure you 
that every single thing that I shared with you inside of this video is entirely legitimate and can totally take away the stress of manually running a referral contest. Another amazing thing about this automation is that every single thing is done for you in templates that you can easily import to your phone and start using ASAP. You don't have to be a tech person or have any coding skills to run this. You can finish the entire setup for this automation in less than 30 minutes. And the best part is, once you have this program, you don't need to worry about doing anything complicated to set it up. It is all done from your Android phone, so that means that you don't need a PC or a laptop at all. All you need is going to be your Android device with very, very good specifications, your autoresponder and Google Sheets, plus the other apps that I'm going to be disclosing inside of the program. All you need to do is just follow the step-by-step -step guide that I'm going to be outlining inside of the program and you're going to be up and running in no time. And here's the sherry on top. You won't have to pay any monthly fees after purchasing this program. It's a one-time charge and you get to keep it for a lifetime. Now, I know that you are probably wondering about the price and you are thinking it's going to be expensive as hell. Well, let me tell you, if you are to hire a professional to set up a referral contest automation for you, it's going to cost you well over 300,000 naira. But I'm not going to be charging you anything close to that amount. I'm not even going to be charging you 150,000 naira or even 100,000 naira. For the first 10 people that are going to be getting this program, they are going to be getting it for a super discount price of 40,000 naira. And for every single person that gets it after that, we'll be getting it for a reasonable price of 50,000 naira. And the price will just keep increasing from there. Anyways, that's going to be all for this video. I hope you found it super useful and informative. Remember, if you want to take your WhatsApp TV to the next level and skyrocket your views, then this referral contest is exactly what you need. So, if you are ready to take action and start seeing results, don't hesitate to click the link in the description of this video to purchase this program. Also, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to this channel and also turn on the notification so that you will be among the first to know when I upload a new video. Anyways, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.